Hey YouTube Wireless Hotshot here. Um, in this video I'm going to show you how to turn your iPhone 3G into uh, iPhone 3GS having three main features and uh, those features are battery percentage, background, and multitasking. Um, before you do this you have to have uh, a jailbroken device and as you see I have a jailbroke with all my jailbroken stuff in there and uh, what you need to do is open up Cydia after you have it jailbroken and uh, then you have to download a file called iFile or an app called iFile. Um, just search for that and it'll look like a Macintosh symbol or whatnot. And it says iFile. And uh, I believe you have to reboot your device after you download it. So go ahead and do that just uh, you know for uh, to be safe. So uh, what you want to do now is open up iFile after you have it downloaded. and if it asks to register or something just click register later and then go all the way back to the very beginning until you have no more thi things up there um, and then you want to navigate to uh, system so go to system library core services uh, springboard.app and then uh, scroll all the way down to the ends and you're going to look for uh, n82ap.plist so n82ap.plist make sure you click the uh, right one the n82ap.plist if, if you click the other one it obviously won't work because that's not right so uh, you don't have to add these um, th lines that I'm going to tell you in this order but it's best to or add it in this order to keep it organized so what you want to do now is click edit up there at the top and uh, then you want to scroll down to where it says string iPhone so look around here and it says string iPhone right here I believe that's right no that's not right I gotta find it here okay string iPhone I click the string iPhone 3G and then what you want to do is uh, click return then go ahead and if you want you can space it until that line and then what you want to add is uh, a less than uh, key k e y and then a greater than gas dash gauge Um, dash battery um, then a less than and then a slash the one that goes this way that kind of slash um, and then type key again pretty much closing it and then a greater than symbol and then push return and space up to that line again if you want to uh, and then the less than symbol and then true and then that same directional slash and then you finish it off with uh, a greater than and uh, so that enables uh, battery percentage so if you want to enable background you scroll down to where it says uh, GPS so it's I believe it's string or no key GPS so you gotta find that it's right there it's like right below that last one and go after where it says true if you can get it in there okay after it says GPS key and then on the next line it says true you click at the end of the true at the end of the uh, greater than symbol then return space to that spot and then you type in less than key greater than home screen uh, wallpaper and uh, a less than oops less than um, what else 
trying to read my notes here and then a slash same slash it's gonna be the same slash every every time and then key with a greater than so if you haven't recognized the pattern yet it's pretty much the same pattern every time except you put in different text in the middle so and then if you know what's next it's true or the greater than or less than then true and then slash greater than and then if you want to add multitasking which may be a big one because iPhone 3G doesn't have multitasking you go to MMS see here MMS right there if you can see that uh, and then at the end of it and then you go on the next line where it says true and then you return it and then space up to the spot again so uh, less than key greater than multitasking and then uh, that greater less than then a slash key and uh, greater than and then you push enter go down and uh, put true and all these things will be listed in the descriptions if you don't know what I'm saying or you can't see so look down in the description for each one and uh, then you slash and greater than so after you got that done and it doesn't have to be in that order or anything it just has to be in there but you gotta do it in a certain way so that the multitasking at the next line it says true so it enables it. I believe when you have false, it disables it so that you don't have to retype everything in. You just got to type false or true. So after you're done with that, click done and save. Then done. Then what you want to do is uh, close the app out. And oh, to show you this, this is an iPhone uh, 3G. This is a you know Apple logo and iPhone stuff. You can't obviously see it at all. This is this is a case, but it's a clear case. But um, yeah. So this is an iPhone 3G. And after you're done with that, you can restart your device or you can do this little app. I believe Respring, you can it restarts it in a quick way. Okay, so I just restarted my device with the Respring and that worked because you can see up there it says 100% battery. If you can see that. I'll try and get that in there. 100%. So obviously I got the battery percentage working, which I should because it's easy. Then I'll do this, and as you can see, I got a background back here too. And to show this is an iPhone 3G again, uh, there's no stuff down there. And uh, then finally, multitasking. Let's just open up Photos app. And you can tell this is an iPhone 3G because it's slow. So let's close that and then open up Messages. It's the airplane mode, I don't care. And then I'll double cl click down there and you can see I got apps open and it does work pretty nicely for a jailbroken device like this. And multitask over to photos. Multitask over to messages. And multitask over to photos again or something. So obviously it does work. And uh, until next time, this is Wireless Hotshot. Um, Tell me in the description, I mean in the comments, tell me if it worked or didn't work. If it didn't work, I'll help you out. And remember that the text will be in the description so that if you don't understand me or something, it'll be down there. So you can easily read it and type it in your own. So until next time, this is Wireless Hotshot.